Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is 2 power x plus 4 power x plus 8 power x is equal to 155. To find the value of x from this equation, so it will be 2 power x plus 4 power x, 4 we want to make 12 base of 2, so 4 it is 2 power of 2, then bracket power of x plus 8, 8 is same as 2 power of 3, then bracket of x is equal to 155. Then it will be 2 of x plus from this exponent and this exponent, which is in the form of a of m bracket of n is equal to a of n bracket of m. So we'll exchange, we exchange the powers. This of n is inside of m, of n, m is outside the bracket. So from here, it will be into here also we'll exchange the powers. Power of x inside, power of 2 outside. So it will be 2 power of x inside the bracket, power of 2 outside the bracket. Then plus, into here we'll take power of x inside, power of 3 outside. So it will be 2 power of x bracket, power of 3 outside is equal to 155. Now into this step, 2 power of x is now in common. So we'll let y is equal to 2 power of x then our equation will be y plus y square then plus y power 3 is equal to 155 then in the next step here from this step here we'll take this if we check we can check from this step so let's check for because this 155 is large number if we check for 1 it will not be equal to 155 if we check for 2, it will not be equal for until y is 5. So here if we check for y is equal to 5. So here it will be 5 plus 5 square plus 5 power of 3 is it equal to 155. So from here, it will be 5 plus 5 square, it is 25 plus 5 power of 3 is 125. 125 plus 25 is 150. 150 plus 5 is equal to 1. 55. So we already see one of the factor of this cubic equation, it is equal to 5. Now let's take this into the left side. So we we'll start by this with the largest power of y power 3, then plus this y square, then plus this y. This will take to this side to be minus 155 is equal to 0. Now from here, we we'll already get from this cubic equation here. We get one of the factor it is five, so this cubic equation can be solved by grouping and factorization. Now from this here 150, so product it is 150, whereas 150 is equal to the product of 31 times five. And this y here y will split, so y is equal to we'll use this 31, so y it will be equal to 31 y minus 30 y. And for this y square, so from y square is equal to here we'll use this 5 so y square is equal to 6 y minus 5 y, I mean 6 y square minus 5 y square so let's split this so it will be this which is y power of 3 then plus y square here we'll use this we'll set by this minus 5 y square then plus 6 y square so here it will be minus 5 y square then plus 6y squared. Then plus y. Plus y, we'll use this here. We'll start by this minus 30y, then plus 31y. So here minus 30y, then plus 31y. Then this minus 155 is equal to this 0. Then in the next step, from here, into this and this, y square is common. So we'll take out of bracket. Then y power of 3 divided by y square, it is y. Minus 5y square divided by y square to be minus 5 bracket. Then from here and here, we'll take 6y is common out of bracket. So this 6y square divided by 6y, it is y. Minus 30y divided by 6y to be minus 5 bracket. Then plus, from here and here, we'll take 31 out of bracket. 31y divided by 31, it is y. 
minus 155 divided by 31 it is minus 5 bracket is equal to this 0 now into here y minus 5 is common so we'll take y minus 5 bracket out of bracket then this divided by this it is this y square this divided by this is this plus 6y then this divided by this is this plus 31 bracket is equal to 0 then from here we have two solutions whereas this first solution y minus 5 is equal to 0 and this second solution y square plus 6y plus 31 is equal to 0 so from here we only get one of the value of y we, when we take negative y to this side so it will be y is equal to 5 now here this is real solution now and this here I want to check if it will give a real solution from determinant formula which is equal to b square minus 4ac so to be determinant is equal to b square it will be this which is 6 square coefficient of y then minus 4 times a a is coefficient of y square which is 1 times c is constant 31 so to be determinant is equal to 6 square is 36 minus 4 times 31 so it will be minus 4 times 1 is 4 4 times 3 is 12 so it will be determinant is equal to from here we'll take this is larger than this so value will be negative now from here to borrow 1 to be 14 minus 6 is 8 here to be 11 minus 3 it is 8 so negative 88 this is less than 0 so if it is less than 0 then no real solution but if it is greater than zero then there is a real solution now if there is no real solution we will deal only with this first solution of y is equal to five because it must be real solution because before we will we recall before it was y is equal to two power of x we are supposed to find the value of y of x so from y is equal to two power of x then we compare these two equations so to be 2 power of x is equal to 5 so from 2 power of x is equal to 5 then from here we will apply log in both sides so it will be log of 2 power of x is equal to log of 5 then this power of x will move to the base so it will be x log of 2 is equal to log of 5 then we we'll divide by log of 2 in both sides sides so this and this will cancel then to be x is equal to log of 5 over log of 2 it will be log of 5 base of 2 so this is the final answer for the value of x in this our problem thank you for watching don't forget these steps to miss out subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video bye bye